pretty humbling to believe it because, uh, I mean, the great thing about Kentucky and the State High School Association is that they let you play when you're third or fourth grade. I mean, very few states will do that. And, 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 and Murray High School is the same way. Not all systems in Kentucky let the younger kids play. And I think that's a great thing if you kids can start anytime you want to. But when I was younger, this was a field. I remember playing wiffle ball, kickball, and then softball. Softball wasn't even, you know, big back then. And I mean, this is amazing that, you know, a few years later that, you know, these courts are named after me. It's really humbling. And uh, believe me, that's what all Stu was saying. I mean, he just kind of over, overdid it a little bit on that. But it all started in high school, believe me. I mean, I mean I've been playing, I played nine years on the high school team. You know, when I grew up, the high school was part of the Murray State. Murray State had a university school, so they let, the reciprocals, they let us play for Murray High. So that was a great thing. Murray High gave me my opportunity to go on and play junior tennis, worldwide tennis, college tennis, and then be on the pro tour. So I really think, you know, all those other uh, awards and everything mean nothing than a state high school championship or playing for the Murray High Tiger. Because I'm a gold, I bleed gold, I bleed racer gold, I bleed black and gold. And, and once again, just thanks everybody. I mean, this is humbling and I'm gonna do everything I can to keep this facility going, you know, try to do some clinics for, I mean, I do a lot of that anyway, but now you put a little pressure on me. Put my name on. Yeah, so, and, and I don't know if y'all remember, last September we have these tournaments, we have about 600 people. So once again, you know, I want to thank, you know, Bob and the Board of Regents. I mean, these are guys I grew up with, Stu, Mark, and Donnie, you know, you did a great job doing all this. And then, of course, thank Chuck Jones, you know, making this facility, not only for the high school people, but from now on, we're going to we're going to bid for tournaments with 600 people in there. So Murray's going to be, we're already on the map in tennis. And hopefully I can, you know, my dad started it all. You know, I mean, here's a guy who was in basketball and comes to town and now has the tennis courts named after him. I mean, that's, so that's, you know, that's the thing. He took tennis to help me out. You know, a guy named Ron Underwood, who's uh, Eddie Hunt's wife's brother, started us playing. So uh, this wouldn't even be possible without Ron Underwood. But that's going to be hopefully my goal for the rest of my life is to, hopefully win another championship at Murray State, the OVC, and maybe try to build up the Murray High program, get it back, and just get people playing. I think that's my main thing is just promote tennis. You know, I look back, I see the Overbees, the Hunt Smocks, the people I grew up with playing, even Bill Whitaker. I have a win over Bill Whitaker, which I don't know. I don't know if I can put that in, the, in my thing. Then Kathy, I mean, people I just grew up playing with, and, you know, there's a state champion right there, Kathy McNutt. Kathy Allen holds a state champion, state high school team. names for each court. That's what I'd like to do overall is to find some of the, the best players and they have each court named after any individual. I'll talk to you guys about that. Stu, anything needs to get done, you, Donnie, and Mark can do it. So, But once again, thanks again for everybody showing